Hello everyone, this is Billy from Pyramida Channel and good to see you again. Today we will have a special guest talking about packaging products that we see in our daily life such as pee bags, snacks, food, pharmaceuticals, cosmetics and many other packaging materials. Have you ever wondered about how packaging materials are made from? How can a single material be transformed to a composite material with a multi-purpose usage? Here we invited Clive Light from Worldly Industrial Company, who is the senior assistant to the president of the company, and who will unveil the mass of the packaging industry and introduce their company's technology. Hello Clive. Hi, really nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Thank you for being here with us today. So, Mr. Clive, can you tell us uh, more about your company and what's the recent uh, situation of the industry? Sure. For over 50 years, Wally has specialized in manufacturing of flexible packaging machinery and relay equipment. Let us say our machines can be categorized in four different parts, mm -hmm. which are rotogravity printing, lamination, coating and extrusion coating laminating machines. Okay. Our flexible packaging equipment is designed for plastic processing, such as PT, BOPP, CPP, nylon, and other plastic film. In addition, Wally has focused a large part of researching on application of aluminum foil packaging. In this way, we can meet special needs and various applications regarding pharmaceutical packaging. In these past few years, we have come to know the demand of medical and medicinal material has been rising. Mm -hmm. Therefore, aluminum foil has been used in high amounts for medical packaging. Now that you have uh, mentioned about your investment on the research for aluminum foil packaging, can you tell us what is the difference between the plastic printing material and aluminum foil printing material? For example, uh, this is a typical flexible packaging in snack food. Mm -hmm. This structure is based on plastic film. Mm -hmm. Because of uh, its different functional requirements, sometimes aluminum foil is used as the packaging material. Now, if we compare between the plastic and aluminum foil, we can see clearly the strength of aluminum foil for its high performance of blocking effectively the penetration of gases. In the other words, oxygen and nitrogen, moreover, it can highly block moisture and UV light as well. Okay. Certainly, due to this property, aluminum foil plays an important role in packaging of food, medical and other. Okay. Until now, we can see aluminum foil is best for better barrier solutions. But what may be the downsides of using this material? What is the technique that your company is using? Good question. Uh, because the st structure strength of aluminum foil normally creates greases on lids and are easy to break. Mm -hmm. Also, low heat sealability. Mm -hmm. Our worldly specialized to integrate an additional process of lamination or coating to enhance the structure and composition causing the aluminum foil materials to eliminate the problem. Okay. Let me give you an example. Mm -hmm. Have you ever seen a yogurt container has a cover on them? Yeah, that's my breakfast every day. Yeah. Well, it's made from a single layer soft aluminum foil and its cover on has the thicker single layer of aluminum foil. Mm -hmm. It will enhance the resistant protection for the moisture, lights, gets, properties. For this happen, it needs to be additionally coated with a heat seal locker mm -hmm. to compatible with the seal plastic container. Mm -hmm. In order to enhance the appearance of the outlook, the outer layer of the aluminum foil can be printed out. Mm -hmm. It requires pre-coat on the printing to improve ink adhesion during the printing process. Okay. Sounds that your technique for a more durable usage on aluminum foil packaging offers a one big solution. Since you gave an example of the yogurt bottle containers, could you tell us what other applications 
are made from aluminum foil in the flexible packaging. Sure, uh, there are four types of uh, application for different process, mm -hmm. such as printing, lamination, coating, and extrusion coating lamination. Okay. For printing, we can process yogurt lead, blister foil, mm -hmm. paper foil, and many others. Okay. For lamination, we can process alu alu foam foil, beverage packaging, electronic packaging, and many others. For coating, we can process foil primer coating, heat seal, and foil protect lacquer, and many others. For extrusion lamination, we can process alcohol swab, water cup lid, cosmetic mask packaging, and many others. Okay, so considering more about the aluminum foil material, how does the printing and laminating machinery for this material be of influence to the demand in the current market? The market share of the printing machines and laminating machines for aluminum foil is now higher than the general flexible packaging. Mm -hmm. But its greatest advantage is that due to the uniqueness and speciality of aluminum foil, it makes it indispensable in markets in the terms of demand. Mm -hmm. During its process, we concern various conditions to prevent the aluminum foil to wrinkle or break. Mm -hmm. This is how Wortley achieves a stable and low wastage winding intention. Okay. Some other things to consider are the aluminum foil coating application requires high temperature drying and the best insulation design and the challenge of the high thick composition laminates in automatic splicing. Okay. These considerations on using different designs and condition makes it unique and very different to the plastic film machines. Mm -hmm. Okay, then I would like to ask you one more question. What are your strengths in terms of designing capabilities and manufacturing process for this particular machine? Uh, we have dealt with various customization requirements and have conducted many success cases. Let me share with you a real cases. Normally, the yogurt cup lid is the application of heat seal coating, but many of our customers have different requirements for a coating methods, coating amount, temperature, production speed, and output. Mm -hmm. In the end, every final design of the mechanism we make for customer turn out to be unique. Okay. Moreover, each coating method has some pros and cons. So we will give detailed technical explanation to our customer according to their characteristic. If the customer has space limitation on factory or they don't need too much production capacity, mm -hmm. we could customize it individually. Okay. As you can see, uh, Wally has a ability to meet the needs of the customers. Mm -hmm. So they can produce a variety of products by integrating the function for dry lamination, wet lamination, mm -hmm. heat steel coating, primer coating, mm -hmm. wax coating, and one color printing, and cold seal registration into a multifunctional machine. Okay. It will be more than enough for a customer to be fully equipped to compete in the full packaging and pharmaceutical packaging. Mm -hmm. And it is indeed, due to Worldly's professional expertise and experience, you're able to meet different customers' requirements. Clive, can you tell me one thing? Can you tell me uh, what's the strength of Worldly's technical area? Sure. In addition to the single side printing on aluminum foil, Worldly has another strength which can print simultaneously and in the same position of both sides of aluminum foil. Okay. Uh, for example, just like the sample in my hands, mm -hmm. the front side we can print uh, company logo and backside, we can print description and ingredient of the medicine. Oh. Okay. Interesting. With the electronic light shaft system, that play on both sides of the printing units, and you need a special reverse method of the function. The aluminum foil can be printed reversely in any of printing units. Mm -hmm. Interesting. For example, a six-color printing machine has a different option of reverse printing, such as 5 plus 1, okay. 4 plus 2, mm -hmm. 3 plus 3. Mm -hmm. Therefore, 
Wokley has accumulated a vast amount of experience, has improved different techniques mm -hmm. to design a unique printing application. Okay. In the last stage of printing, not only we can do histological coating, mm -hmm. but we can process washing, primer coating, printing, and histological coating through all in one single stage. Mm -hmm. Companies can save costs of manpower and improve their production efficiency. Okay. Thank you, Mr. Clay, for your time here and for giving us a great insight of what kind of packaging can be made from your printing machine. It's my pleasure. Thank you very much. And to our audience, if you would like to inquire about Mr. Clark machines, you can write a comment below or you can hit the link below to visit Worldly's website. See you in the coming videos and remember to stay tuned.